4th of July weekend, and what better thing to do than to shoot a little lead, have a little air gunning. Got a few slugs here we're going to try out in the hot sun flash. It's regulated. We, uh, we got it tethered. The bottle is uh, empty from 4,500. Um, it's down to 3,500 PSI, which is where I run this gun. Is at 3,500 PSI instead of 3,000. Um, we got a little wind reader. We got the tablet out here for a little bit of a uh, YouTube action while we're shooting this today, and uh, it's going to be a good day. And uh, yeah, so we'll see how it goes. And uh, yeah, plan on having some fun. See you guys later. All right, everybody, I'm going to rifle off some rounds down there at the flash pile. I have a big, I don't know, it's like a one foot by one foot reactive target, and we're going to shoot some rounds at it, and uh, yeah, we'll see how it does. I haven't sighted it in for slugs. I haven't ever shot slugs through it, so I don't know what it's going to do. Um, it's only shot JSBs and uh, 25 grain, um, it has a hot sun regulator in it that's uh, adjusted to uh, about 135 bar, it's running at 3500 PSI, we'll shoot a couple rounds off, we'll see how it goes, alright, let's see, oh, and uh, I did bring a decibel reader, and uh, we have chronograph going. I have no idea where we're going to hit. So, oh, oh, that just fell off of there. I don't think we really needed it. It'll still go. Let's shoot a couple rounds. Well, I'm going to let you guys see exactly where I'm standing, so you guys aren't wondering where I'm shooting. I am shooting for that, that target out there. So I will, um, you're going to see me shooting at it here. Would you rather, rather see me shooting the gun or me hitting the target? How about we'll get sighted in with it like this, and then I'll shoot the target and readjust it. Okay. Adjusted. There we go. All right, I'm just gonna try to hit papers down there right now. So I'm gonna aim for the middle of the bullseye of the whole paper. I don't think I'll hit the arrow. I don't think I'll hit the alley. Let's adjust our cant. All right. We are ready. Ooh. Seven hundred forty. Slow, but these are 26 grain. It almost hit the bullseye. Oh, that was lower. Let's just get slower. Seven hundred five. Seven hundred. One. So it looks like we maybe settled in about 700 feet per second in its current tune. But I'm not hitting terribly low. I mean, like an inch low of where I'm aiming, but the spread isn't the hottest yet. So we'll uh, shoot some more rounds, but I'm going to focus in on that and let you guys see a few rounds fly down there and hit it. 
and then I'll, I'll be at a, uh, slugs in the magazine here in a second. All right, guys, I wish it was going to be better than that, but that's about, that's 50 yards out zone with my phone. So I'm going to aim for the top left corner. And we look like we got maybe four more rounds left in this magazine. We are tethered, so we should still be getting pretty good consistency because we're tethered at 3,500 PSI and uh, we still get quite a few shots. So I'm going to aim for the left upper target pull zone for it. That's what I'm aiming for. No reading on the chronograph there. In. With the stock air tank and me running it at 3,500 PSI, I get about three magazines, 30 shots before I need to refill the, before I run down to the reg pressure and drop fall off the reg. So, just in case anybody wondered. I haven't uh, played with it much. Um, I haven't really adjusted the hammer spring because you got to take it out of the stock to do that and everything. So it's not exactly easy. Um, and uh, yeah, so I'm loading up a magazine here. Sorry, everybody. I hate watching people load magazines. I was like, why don't you have them already loaded? Well, <laughs> I didn't think about it, I guess. All right. All right, here we go. Next round. Same spot, upper left. Target. 700. 17. 700. 14. These are flying through the same hole when they. 700. 10. 700. 10. 700. 3. 700. 17. Seven hundred ten. Seven hundred fourteen. All right, let me see drink. <laughs> Let's walk down here, and I will uh, show you guys the target. Hang. I'll zoom you guys back. We're walking down there. So, let's come down here and see what we're doing here. This is at 50 yards, and this is the first time shooting slugs, so, you know, I couldn't expect a lot. These are JSBs. All right. So, well, that's it. That's what we're seeing. You know, was it bad? Nah. Was it good? Uh -uh. But it wasn't horrible. I mean, that would have been a dead squirrel for the most part. That's my thumb. So, a lot of them wanted to hit here. And then, it looks like I had a couple right here. But that's more than 10 shots, you know, because I reloaded the magazine. So, not all these shots were the last 10. But, that's it, guys. Well, um... It's shooting pretty slow, but at 700 feet per second, it's still hitting almost bullseye of where it was shooting uh, pellet. So, well, that's pretty good, I guess. But it's shooting pretty slow. I think I will uh, try to turn the hammer spring up and probably... Uh, maybe mess with the reg, but we'll see. That's it, everybody. Have a good one.